That's following the head. Yeah, more often than not, you have no health after the manhandler. And so bringing the recorder lets you do that. So, like, the other big thing, right? Going from level 1 up to get the uh, 30 secret is entirely an I'm getting the blue ring strat. Uh, going up there to get the power bracelet, I feel like, is a maybe. Because you could just do that after level 6 if you don't care about the money. I care about the money, but then I go up to actual first quest 6 after getting the ladder to get the, another 30. Oh no. That was one of my bomb chances. And then basically the time between the ladder and the three split here and it being huge compared to uh, good runs. Is uh, getting money to buy a ring. And actually, then there's time. It's not really visible in these splits. There's time between four and eight. Well, between three and four, that is actually buying the ring. That was 16. <laughs> Also, thank you for the host. I don't know if there is an official blue ring route for uh, second quest. Because the problem is uh, it's a low money seed. I think I'm actually collecting every 30 secret and the only 100 secret. Record Out also collects the only 100 secret because that's its... um. Yeah, I needed to kill the blue one first and I'm used to that being the only one there. Record Route gets the Hundo secret because it buys the candle the same way I buy the candle. It's just at a slightly different time. And then you use the arrow money to buy the air. Use the Hundo secret to buy the arrows. Oh. Um, yeah, you could just do money making game. At least we got the um, the heart there, so we're not listening to beats. Right now. I have no idea what my count is. Actually, I got no. I, I killed. Well, now I know what my count is. Three, four. I don't even know. Should have killed the red one first. It's about to say I'm short on cash. I need a bomb from one of these money mummies. Is that 16, so I missed a bomb opportunity probably in that mess? Doesn't matter. Up and A also gives this route, that Zal pattern in there. If you uh, walk there from that 30 secret spot, one of them is right in the way. So the room before that one with the bats, if you're doing no up A, um, you exit the recorder room into there, but there's a shutter room door to go back down towards the start where you have to go. That's why you'll see runners in, uh, you know, I guess the main category there. 
What was that? I don't understand. Oh. This is surprisingly okay. I actually don't need bombs, and the next item I'm gonna need is the recorder. So miraculously, this works. I don't know if I got a bomb drop here anyway. That room drops a five rupee. Let's go. That was slow. Fifty five zero. I got my bomb drop. I need to remember if I need a bomb drop and I get it there, just go. Because there's no way I'm not getting hit by whiz robes and traps in level 6. blindfolds. So this is harrowing. Oh. I'm mostly concerned about two hit blue wizard robes, so one heart is surprisingly not terrible. So one, two, three. And just wait for that blue wizard robe to not go diagonally down and left. This is terrifying, but it's surprisingly consistent. So with no up A in that room I just went through, you go down into a Chevy room that's packed with whiz robes and a key in the center. And that's actually a faster key to get than the Gibdo one, and it makes the first maze room in that uh, is in this dungeon easier to escape from. Or you do this. Oh, don't do that. We made it. This is a good amount of money, actually. Three. Because knowing your second quest recorder spots is actually important. The level 2 Triforce counts as getting level 3. Because Zelda. 
I think uh, the record route comes to get this candle much later, but because I'm getting a blue ring after level 3, I need it a lot sooner. And now we get this mess of finding money. Take that hurt. There's a 10 secret there, by the way. If you want to keep your hearts from the mugger rooms, you basically need to also get the 10s. Goals to be very close to 250 by the time I. Well, honestly, by the time I'm out of level 3. So being over 220 is already good. And I want more fives. This is the last switch to the recorder. Uh, the record route, I think, the record route now doesn't even get Magical Sword and sticks to White Sword for the end game. I'm getting Magical Sword. I'm actually getting both swords. Yes, I want that, actually. coming from that now. Switching to bombs for a little while. I don't think I actually need the candle again until level 7. The Record Rat also, without Magical Sword, really, has the benefit of not needing to uh, get this heart container and can just go through this room. Sure, there's a five in there. I'm gonna need the ten. I should just get the ten on the way. I'm going to credit the uh, double the dongo hit. This is why I should get that 10 secret. That I'm still just walking by because I feel like if you get lucky, you don't need it. If you don't get lucky, you you end up in this situation and you need it. 
I need a rupee from something. Thank you, Blue Octara. That saves a menu later. I probably already wasted the time by leaving the screen. I still need money. Uh, so I have the 230 secrets and there's 10 rupees in a rupee boss room in four. Arrow, that gives you 70. I need 80. There's a 10 secret right next to the uh, arrow shop on the coast. What's going to happen is I'm going to clear level 4. I'm going to record her back over to 3 because I'm, I need to get out of the Lost Hills. And we're going to collect the 230 secrets. The Raft Heart. This is for Magical Sword. The Coast Heart. And then we're going to buy arrows in the Coast Shop. Nice. That's five of the rupees we need. I think we are killing four Poles Voice along the way, so... I very often consider switching the candle just to light that room up and hope that makes it a little easier to navigate. It's a diagonal room. Santa Link! Dig Dogger, please. This is a five die room. Oh my goodness, what was that? I have hearts, this is the just go through it room. There's no reason to kill those alls other than looking for money or health or something. I didn't know it was possible to miss so many sword stabs. money from the other room. I still need four rupees. Uh, the other easy way to get five is to kill everything on the coast and not get hit. And get a couple of little fives that way. That's one of the reasons to have the ladder here. Grinding for the money to pay the muggers is also just painful. At that point, you're either collecting all the tens or you're probably going to any place in the game where you feel comfortable getting a lot of money. The coast blue tektite grind, killing things in the grave, whatever floats your boat. I think you know how second quest works. The most troll item in the entire game. 
I'm grabbing that. Alright. Alright, Dodongo. Not going to complain. actually felt pretty good. Run, 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 run. Compared to goal split, I'll take that actually. Uh, two. I have 20 rupees, so we're good. At this point, I want these extra rupees because I need to kill a Goma in level 5. And what always happens is I have, like, no money left by the time I'm in there. I have more than once killed that Goma with exact ammo. Which is terrifying. Although I guess if I'm actually worried about money, I just kill the, uh, them all the worms and eight. Army of Octorox walking straight up. That was terrifying. Don't get touched by a bubble. Your run's over. I mean, you can find a blue bubble. But, uh, yeah. Don't touch a red bubble. Mm. It's moving up, so I guess that's good. Oh, kill the... 
piece in there, or your ladder won't apply on the... Uh, like, there will be too many sprites, I think. And your ladder won't get put down. You can't... You have to wait for the boomerangs to go away. Yo, I heard you like triple the Dongo rooms. Execution. Alright, outside of some slow patches at 9, that was it. Man, I couldn't save that time last time because my Ganon kill was really good. So, uh, okay. By my count, there's all of five rooms in the game where having the magical sword makes a difference. Was it five? It's five. A blue wizard of room in, five, in level five. The three blue dark nut rooms of level seven. I guess it's six rooms because there's two Patras. I'm not even counting Ganon. Uh, my recorder is at five. Three. Another key in this room, I don't know if it's on Rue's spreadsheet, it almost has to be. What even? Um if you, you we have to go down from here to pick up the the bow. The room you can walk through the wall on the left, and there's a key in there. I think the problem with it is dodging blue wizard robes to walk through that wall and bo bo dodging bubbles to walk through that wall. Maybe I should have gotten out the bombs. I don't know if I saved time by not menuing or what, but I actually managed to do that room without getting hit a lot, so there's that. This room has a key. This is why I wanted rupees. bubbles. It's going left. Only the right's fine because the key's over there. That's still a cycle. Mm, we'll see. Losing time to something like that is almost expected but you still don't like to see it. Oh wow, it's clear. That never happens. NSU. This is a disaster. I think that's one of the bracket rooms. Minus sign rooms? I don't know what they're called. I 
I don't know if I even needed those bombs. I don't think I did. But they're mine now. There it is. Blue ring, magical sword, Gleok. Okay. All right, this is where things get fun. Seven. Same deal as before, except now I have another nine hearts. Actually, this pattern is different too, so just go. You can take a staircase in this room and go into the room that's too north of here. And then bomb down and get the key anyway. This is losing time, but not as much as last time, I think. I don't need that money at this point. What's left in here? That's terrifying, not having a sword. I'm pretty sure I just kill Goma though and I'm done, so I'm okay. Yeah, I lost a bunch of time. Leave the screen! Leave the screen! We went to seven. One. Two. We save time by not using the recorder on the screen with a recorder, I think. There. I think. Do I even need any bombs? I think for the rest of the game, the only bombs I need... I need... F I, you need four bombs to get to clear level nine. And one of those bombs is just to get in the front door. Okay. How about you? This is another bracket room. I 
I don't know what that room is. I think it's a moat room. This is a terrible room. I don't need that money. Just go, go, go. not great. That's not great. Nice clip. That's more for refill purposes. Oh, I'm on two. I need to go to four and then six. Shouts to the recorder. I probably should have just grabbed that heart. This room is annoying. See, I figure that's Patra 1. It's like instinct, get the money, get the money, get the money. Let's go.
Thank you, fairy. There's a spot room? I don't know what they call this room. That's the last bomb we need. No, no, we need one more. One. We still need bombs next. Like that was a good Patrick kill. I had, like, monster Ganon kills in the last few PBs. Come on, come on. Scroll. We did the thing. We lost time on the Ganon kill, but the Patrick... Well, no, Patrick 3 was the same bad kill. Uh, the block... The ladder clip in 6 was bad, but we still cut 43, which I think was the big thing I wanted to do. I've had runs that are 5 to... Yeah, you know, 5 to 10 seconds faster out of 2. We actually hit every split in this run. Some of Bess is in a very weird state, and I need to correct it. I think I'm calling it here, but there, there's a better level, a better second quest PB that actually follows the streaming requirement rules. What do we have now, though? Terraria, it's saying one hour, and he's ten minutes into this nonsense. All right, let's screenshot this. <laughs> 